What's up? Y'all, I'm making a disc wall. Did it just refine? What's poppin', y'all? I'm making a disc wall because I have a wall that's empty and I have a lot of discs. So, I'm gonna put them on the wall. So should I be measuring? Yes. Should I plan at all? Yes. I'm not going to. So I have a lot of really good ideas. I think that's safe to say. Planning, execution, I'm iffy at that. So, but as you can tell, I'm ahead of it. I understand. I have a lot of discs. Let me count. I have 32 discs in my room. 32. What's seven times three? What's seven times three? 21. You stupid. If I did three rows of seven, that'd only be 21 of them. 32 in my room. Eleven. So three rows of seven. Sounds good to me. Update. I thought I was smart. I'm not. I had two good ideas in a row, so I'm basically a genius. And two time lapse. I didn't mean to treat you wrong, right, did it just for fun. Just for when you left me out for dead, I had no choice but run. I got three O's on my line, but they the planets you the sun. Yeah, so to see my ride at Hard part's done. I just finished putting up all the nails. I was smart about it and actually used, I used this because I couldn't find a ruler. And it was 13 inches. But, so I just measured, this probably 12, I don't know, I just measured between here and here. I drew a little thing on, on here with this, and I just, I, maths. So now I'm going to tell you guys about the discs that I'm going to put up there, in case you care. Let me talk about that. Alright y'all, real quick, so what I'm going to do is just tell you about the frisbees as I put them up on the wall. First, I have the very first frisbee I ever, ever bought. And I got it at Play It Again Sports, which is just a, a secondhand sports shop. Um, where I live, I paid $13 for this frisbee. I think that's the most I've ever paid for a frisbee. Um, it's a PDGA, Pro Disc Golf Association, approved, but it's very much an ultimate disc. I don't know. I love it. I have bled all over this disc, dried blood, who knows. It is smooth again because there's so many scrapes on the outside of this thing. Track numbers stuck on here. My name written a few times. Laser engraved, if you can see on the light here. Um, AJ on there in shop class. This is my very first frisbee, so it's gonna go up up top because I love it. Um, now I've got this Morven Park disc. Before I started playing Organized Ultimate, I played summer league and spring league. I met um, my first high school coach there and recruited him to be my high school coach. It's, it's my roots. We love more. Shout out Morven Park Ultimate. It's my roots. So shout out Morven. Next up is um, Cut Camp. Cut Camp was the first camp I ever went to. I went to Cut Camp before I'd really even played like a full season of Ultimate. So many amazing coaches. Jack Williams, Jonathan Nethercutt, Rowan McDonald. Rowan was my coach at my very first Cut Camp. Anything is possible, y'all. I was out here wearing wide receiver gloves. I look goofy. But I was out there learning. You know, we've upgraded to AUA now. But still, shout out Cut Camp. We love Cut Camp and all my amazing Cut Camp coaches. Too many to name. It's a blessing. Shout out Cut Camp. Next is Disc Store. It's the OG. This is when I started buying Frisbees not from secondhand stores. Disc Store is where I got them. I'd get like misprinted overruns and, and just like nice clean ones like this. My friend Ben Francis was on the Disc Store trick shot team one time and I thought that was the coolest thing on earth. You know we love Disc Store. Classic. I love it. Next is Fairfax Ultimate. It is uh, where I started playing Organized Ultimate as a high schooler in the uh, high school league and we played uh, with that with that coach that I met at Morven Park. Alexi and Doug ran it um, when I first came up. I got to play against Yorktown and HB um, in like spring and fall tournaments. Dreams come true at that time. I've got a ton of Fairfax Ultimate discs but I love them. Shout out Fairfax Ultimate. This is just a Discraft Ultra Star. This is the disc that's been in my shower for a long time. It's just really clean. I don't think I've ever thrown it outside, and I like it, and it looks pretty. So, it's going up on the wall. I have another Fairfax Ultimate disc. This one has a giraffe with sunglasses on it, so it's kind of cool. All right, if you couldn't tell, that top row was kind of my, my roots discs, my high school, my early Frisbee career discs, and the probably the most sentimental ones. 
This second row, I'm gonna do my colorful discs. I have two light up discs. This is the first one. This is when I really started like making videos with frisbees. I would go outside when I was first learning to throw a flick and just chuck a flick as far as I could when I got home from track practice at night. And I'd so I got these light up ones that you could barely see in the camera. I just really love this uh, these light up discs. I have a red one and a blue one. Uh, next, I have this really hard superhero disc. You know, we love superheroes. It's got Batman on here. It's got DC superheroes. Y'all know I love Batman. People are always like, oh my goodness, that disc is so cool. But it sucks. It's really hard. Like, it sucks. It's going to look pretty up on the wall. Um, next, I have this silver spray-painted disc. It has the colors of the four high schools in my county that had Frisbee teams when I was in high school. Heritage, Loudoun County, Riverside. There might only have been three teams. Sorry for the hate if I'm... Yeah, I think it was probably just three teams. I mean, we played Robinson a lot, but Robinson's not from Loudoun County, and that's not really their colors. We played three, like, round-robin kind of things. Um, we played 2015, 2016, and 2017. 2015 and 2016 County destroyed us. They kids that are at BYU now, they killed us. They just were so much better than us. They used to call me gloves because I wore wide receiver gloves. I was a hooligan. 2017, Heritage won it. So I still have it. It's the flat ball. It's the Loudoun County Championship disc, first and last. All right, not to get all sappy on you, but this is my absolute favorite Frisbee. <laughs> I, I love this disc so much. So you let invite Frisbee. It was the trophy for the developmental bracket in 2017 at Eula and Heritage played BCC Bethesda Chevy Chase and we lost the championship for the developmental bracket. Window, who is my club coach for Watch Dogs for the past three years, was coaching BCC and he saw me and, and really like really appreciated how I played but just being as spirited as I could be as a young fiery little kid um, who had just come from track and football and basketball to the ultimate frisbee which is a little bit of a, a different mindset and his team decided that they wanted to give me this as a spirit award um, in the spirit circle after the game and it was the first spirit award I'd ever gotten I before then I had always been criticized for spiking the disc and for yelling and for just getting hype which in my book is just hyping my team up yeah, I'm not even thinking about the other team just hyping my team up it made me feel like I could be who I was um, in ultimate which is what I love so I really appreciate this disc. It, it means a, a ton to me. So it's going up on the wall. All right, next we have um, this red disc. I coached cross country. I was an assistant cross country coach for my mom, who's a head cross country coach at Heritage this past season. But I love coaching so much, and normally frisbee. But it was it was great to get the opportunity to coach to coach cross country, and they had a great season. All the kids did, and it was super duper fun. I learned a lot. They taught me a ton. I learned a lot about myself. It was just a great time. And this is my coaching gift at the end of the year. They uh, all the seniors signed a signed a frisbee and put some heritage stickers on it. It means a lot, so it's going up on the wall. Last are the colored discs. Um, this is the one I just hydro dipped the other day. I know I told y'all I might give it away, but I'm going to do a better one because this one, I didn't hydro dip it all the way. You can still kind of see the Fairfax Ultimate logo underneath it. Um, but this, I hydro dipped right before Breeze tryouts this year, so it's kind of a, a, a new milestone, I guess, um, going into hopefully my second season on the DC Breeze. Blue and purple. Blue and purple are my two favorite colors. Black's definitely my third favorite color, and so it's going up on the wall. Alright, this last row is not the leftovers, but it's the miscellaneous. I have this 2017 US Open disc. Um, I got it um, for playing at YCC's in 2017. I was on Swing Vote, the mixed team from DC. I sat out a lot in 2017. It really put into perspective what I could do um, for a team not playing. But on the sideline, I could be the best teammate possible. I could always have high energy. I could be hyping my teammates up. I could make sure I knew each one of my teammates individually and what got them going and what they needed at certain points, which is a huge, 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 huge skill to have. When you know your teammates, 
so well that if one teammate likes to be left alone, you can make sure your other teammates know that. If one teammate needs to get yelled at and screamed at in their face, like that might be what they need. If they just need to get hyped up, have a laugh, you can be there for them. I just love, love this tournament, even though I didn't play a lot, which is really important to me. So up on the wall. Next up is this sparkly Distore disc. Um, it looks really nice. Um, I found this at YCC's in 2018. So the year after I played for Swing Boat, I played for Foggy Bottom Boys, and that was the first time I really felt connected to a team. I really felt like family. Like, those were my boys, um, Foggy 2018. I had never before felt like part of a team um, on an Ultimate team. I'd always just been out there having fun playing Ultimate, but I never felt like a family on and off the field. That goes a long way on the field, and because we were so tight and we worked so hard, we ended up winning YCC's in 2018. Shout out YCC's 2018. Um, this is, I don't even know exactly, this is a college ultimate disc and it says black squirrels on it. I found this at a tournament and I really like black squirrels. You see them a lot in Canada, at least I do. Whenever I'm in Canada, I see black squirrels. Also, we need more diversity in ultimate, so black anything, I'm down for that. Keeping with the found disc motif, um, I have a Drexel ultimate disc. I really wanted to go to Drexel at one point. Um, I also have some boys uh, who play for Citywide and Drexel who are pretty cool ultimate dudes, so shout out Drexel Ultimate and Citywide Ultimate. This disc is from Boone, North Carolina. Um, I found this at a tournament in North Carolina. I absolutely love North Carolina Ultimate. I went to Cut Camp three times in North Carolina. Some of my favorite Frisbee players from North Carolina. I love North Carolina. It says, clear skies in the rain, in the snow, in the wind, in hail, in fog, 2018. It's just, you always gotta be on your grind. So, love this disc. Next we have this Central Maryland Ultimate Disc. I started playing Ultimate Maryland just after Fairfax. Um, I would drive up there and play in this indoor, indoor league. I played for um, Watch Dogs out of Bethesda. And just uh, now I coach BCC. I might be doing some coaching in Montgomery County. I just love Maryland. It's my second home. Um, so shout out Maryland Ultimate. This also has a ton of people's names on the back. Now it has mine, and it's going on the wall. Last but not least, I have this Disc Northwest disc. I found this at a tournament just a few weeks ago. Washington or Oregon College Ultimate. Dylan Freechild was my favorite player for the longest time. He went to Oregon, so it's just some nostalgia, just some Northwestern love. Um, also, shout out Dylan Freechild because I learned how to do this in his uh, in his Callahan video, and it's probably still the coolest thing I can do with the frisbee. You can change it up, ah, put it on the wall. All right, so that should be all of them. However, I found this disc um, over here hanging up on a shelf, and I just forgot about it. I'm gonna replace one of these Fairfax Ultimate discs. With this one, it is a USA Ultimate Disc. It is signed by Goose Helton, Dylan Freechild, Bo Kittredge, Cassidy Rasmussen, and Jimmy Mickle. This is a GOAT disc. I met these guys when they were training for the US national team, and they came through Leesburg um, at Morven Park, actually, and they had a practice there, and then they did a little clinic. Um, they just, they were out there, and I had to go meet them. And I did, and now I've I've played against Bo in the ADL now, and that was absolutely insane. Um, since after I got this, Goose was my coach at Cut Camp. These guys are on a different level for me. I just hold these guys so high up um, in my eyes, and <sighs> disc is gonna go up on the wall. So shout out these five. I love them, especially Goose. Goose is Goose is one of my favorite people. Like, Goose is so fun. If you guys don't know Goose, go watch Goose Highlights. Goose is the best. Um, here we go. All right, thanks for hanging out with me. This is my disc wall now. I hope you guys like this video. Uh, let me know down in the comments what you want more of, what you want to see, if you want to see vlog, me do little projects like this, workouts, throwing tutorials, anything really. Um, just let me know. Uh, I love spending time with you guys, and I'll definitely have some more content on the way. All right, be different and drink water. Be different and drink water. Drink water and be different? What is it? Is it drink water and... Oh, also, I'm going to do a giveaway of a Hydro Dip disc. Put in the comments what colors you want. Um, and maybe me and Rowan will sign it. Uh, I don't know. But, yeah. Also, I have so many more discs, y'all. I have a lot of discs. But, I'm rambling. 
Uh, I'll see you guys on the next video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Be different and drink water. It's AJ, that frisbee guy. Thank you. I didn't mean to treat you wrong, I did it just for fun When you left me out for dead, I had no choice but run I got three O's on my line, but they the planets, you the sun Yeah, I saw to see my ride or die, couldn't last a month, yeah Broke ass rockin' like you wanted Dior Told her lighten up, I'm tryna make you be more